Good morning. I'm afraid it's more about Gonzalo Lira this morning. And the Duran. You'll notice that the Duran have been incredibly quiet about um, Gonzalo Lira's arrest and disappearance. Um, one of the reasons I wouldn't, you know, lots of people have been, you know, slating them and slagging them for, for not saying anything. But can I just say something that um, one of the reasons why they're probably being quiet, which is sensible, is that the SBU, the people that, you know, the, the Secret Security Service of Ukraine, um, monitor the Duran. You know, quite, quite well. I mean, obviously they, you know, and I think they, you know, like if you look at my previous video that I put up about saying that Gonzalo Leo was arrested and just sort of blah, 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 talking about that. Even that video was attacked by, um, I mean, I, I believe it's the SBU actually they're probably instigating that like you know the um the, the personal attacks and the, the attacks on it was <laughs> quite entertaining actually <laughs> down to the fact that I I have English teeth <laughs> I am not shaving and I have a leather hat <laughs> <laughs> they, they attacked everything like you know which is quite funny really right oh look there's something just quickly a change of subject to ramsons very 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 edible taste of garlic people some people call it wild garlic but it's not actually it's ramsons it's something very very different i thought probably my filming was probably a bit off there so there you go Right, yes. So, it looks like Gonzalo was under house arrest, which is why he didn't leave Ukraine after the first time that he was taken by the SBU. They released him, but kept him under house arrest, apparently. And if he was going to try to leave Ukraine, he would have been treated as a terrorist and would have possibly been, you know, um, both basically um, shot. So everybody's saying, why Why was Gonzalo Lira um, in there? Why didn't he just get pack his bags and go? I don't think he had the option to pack his bag and go. He was there. Um, that might also explain the chuffing on the fags because... Um, I think that he felt that, you know, he did, he was on a very short fuse anyway. He might as well enjoy a few fucking smokes while he's, uh, you know, going. But I think it's time for the American and Chilean embassies to actually get in touch with Ukraine and see if they can get him out. Because that's the only hope, really. I don't, you know, I, I mean, I don't know if, you know, if they would have offed him or bopped him by yet, because uh, there seems to be quite a sort of like a hue and cry about him being taken away. So it's not anything that's been done, been, can be done beneath the radar. And, uh, they, oh, actually, here we have here something, just, uh, this is wild garlic. Slightly different. Down at the bottom there, they've got little tubers, and they're gorgeous. Actually, they're very small. They're not like um big garlic cloves or anything like that, but they're um they've got little tubers and tiny little garlic cloves. But the taste is absolutely delicious. Um, you collect them after they flowered in the summer. So, yes, just a short one about thing. But the Duran, I'm sure they're not saying because they're not saying too much because they don't want to prejudice. Um, Gonzalo any more than he's already been prejudiced, okay? So, and the SBU, if you're watching this, um, yeah, you're a bunch of wankers, really, aren't you?
yeah, all you can do is insult my insult my hat and my teeth and my beard and the fact that I'm having to breathe through my mouth whilst walking up a hill. <laughs> anyway, peace and love, people. Thank you very much, but and we'll all pray for Gonzalo, yeah?